Uh, I would like to dedicate this song to a very special someone in the office. I've heard the consensus that you are pretentious But my honest sense is you're just conscientious And I find that charming I find that charming Catch my attention every time that you mention some blanket contention to a social convention that I find alarming and I find that charming. in disarray Cause I don't know if this is okay But I'd feel like a landlocked sailor If I didn't come right out and say Hey Kate You're all that I want Yeah Genius to see what's between us And everyone's seen this So you know you've not dreamed this It's just How much You charmed me And I find that Charming Oh, I always knew you liked me More than Taylor, D. What? No, no Oof. Oh. And, Um <laughs> This is great It's good <laughs> this is, uh, not how I imagined this day. Hey, Kate! Did you like it? Did it work? She liked it? Dude, I wrote that song for Taylor. I know, so I thought we could kill two birds with one stone. Well, you definitely killed one bird. And of course I'm exclusively talking about You know, you're quite beautiful when you cry. No. It's... It's... beautiful when you cry. Go away, Rust. I'll stay. Thank you. You know, it's clear. You're in an awful lot of pain, and I just want you to know no one deserves it more than you. What is your problem with me? Why do you hate me so much? I don't hate you. Yes. You do. Well, yes, in the conventional sense, I, I hate you. But if I'm being honest, it's not your fault. You know, I can't really see what you see in your head, right? Oh, right. You haven't developed that ability yet. Mm -hmm. Very well. I will try to explain it in a way that you will understand. Okay. Of course. Once in a lab was a lonely scientist, shining bright and brilliant like the star in the sky. He was headed straight to the top till he fell love. Why is everybody singing today? Her eyes were a tumultuous ocean, and her hair was a communist curl. How could he ignore all the times that she swore that together they'd conquer the world? Okay, I think I get it. Now oh. once in a life, maybe less for a scientist, does a lovely gal with a lust for the sciences confess devotion and undying love. You see how he could be taken and her experiments a small price to pay. 
Her smiles and her nods were worth the pricks and the prods, cause she was his at the end of the day. I don't remind you of her, do I? Then one summer night she came to the scientist Told him she'd been lying in the interest of science His broken heart was just some date on love I've gazed on the face of the devil And named every eyebrow and freckle The image ever burned in my brain She used love as a tool to make me a fool So I feel nothing but hate and disdain Okay now my iron-clad heart is devolving to dust. That's why they call me Rust. I didn't sell so my name. I am so sorry, Please I hadn't... Please flip over the tape for Rust's great adventures in suck. <clears throat> I'm sorry, I had no idea. Well, now you understand why I have to hate you. Well, no, actually, I don't understand that... Burn in hell, she did. Oh, okay. No. Taylor. Okay. Taylor, there you are. Look, are those puppets? He... Mm-hmm. Look, about that song. Oh, it was just... David, you are so romantic. Uh, it's, uh... Oh, and now for a subliminal message. Subscribe. Actually, I'd like to take this moment to uh, talk about something that's Pretty serious. My doctors say that I only have a couple months to live, but but you can help. Subscribe. Does that make sense? <sighs> Thanks. It's, it's literally will save my life if you do that. Now again, you just take your subscribe. <sighs> this feels a lot better to get off my chest. Like maybe I might live a little bit longer. I know you do the right thing and be supportive, and I appreciate that. Now again. Go down. And don't forget to tell your friends about research. Why am I interrupting myself? Don't let me die!